So now you have uh, you have some pieces of paper, uh, maybe yellow, green, pink, whatever it would be, right? Um, you also have your uh, your your flip video camera. Uh, let me show you what what it looks like. It kind of looks like this. It's already kind of set up on on a, on a on a tripod, and then you also have your th uh, your white piece of paper. The goal at the end of the day is for you to be able to uh, to take your flip video camera, turn it on, and as you can see, you'll be able to look into your into your flip video camera, and your goal is to press the uh, the record button, the red button, and to actually move things in and out of your camera, displaying and showing um, how you'll be able to solve a problem. Now, there's many different ways for you to be able to solve a problem. Uh, with using a vid your video method. So you would move things in and out. So you would have a problem written out in a Sharpie or um, in a really dark color. And what you would do is you would, you would move through the process of solving a problem, like reading through the problem, organizing its information, determining why you would use a Think1 strategy for this one, um, why Think1 would be important, or why a Venn diagram would be important, or or even um, sometimes, why would algebra be best to be used in this problem? Um, that's the key issue with a lot of our with our problem solving strategies: when to use them and what, and why would it be effective to be able to use them during this you know, during these particular problems. You want to use these pieces of paper to uh, or, and order them, and then move them in and out of your movie, displaying your mastery of knowing how to use these problem solving strategies. So that's how we create a video. And uh, we'll see how you guys do when, when um, in track four and track one on, on some of our using our Edzakara problem-solving methods. All right, we'll see you. Uh, see you next week.